During his visit at this elementary school in Cherokee County today, Governor Kemp said that he continues to have the same concerns about mandates and is planning on leaving that decision up to local educators and keeping it out of the hands of government. Every school is different. There are different neighborhoods they're in different counties. You know, they're rural, they're suburban, they're urban. And, you know, I for one have been for the most part when I could be a local control governor when it comes to education. The governor adding he trusts the school system because he believes they've adequately handled coronavirus issues over the last 15 months. We're doing the same thing we did last year. We're trusting the local school systems, the local boards to work with their parents, work with their administration and make good decisions for each individual school. According to the Associated Press, about 30% of public schools in Georgia have some kind of mask mandate. Masks are optional in the rest. Some parents have told 11 Alive it's led kids who opt to wear a mask to be bullied. We asked Governor Kemp about it. Well, look, if, if I was that parent, I'd be talking to the principal at the school and the teachers and making sure that that's not happening. I mean, I'm very confident the local systems can deal with that. The governor and the first lady said they chose to visit Ball Ground Elementary today to express their gratitude to teachers and staff for their resilience and dedication over the last year. The visit comes at a time when thousands of students across the state are heading back to the classroom. And as the governor faces pressure from fellow Republicans, to ban mask mandates in schools.